What's up, you guys? This is Mary with HPI High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. It's free general collective reading for all signs. Capture the side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. Thanks for all the new subscribers. Thanks for all the love and support to my channel. I uh, appreciate it so much. Uh, and thanks for all the shares of my content on social media and word of mouth. I appreciate it. Okay, I want to say this real quick before I deliver this channeling. Um, this is to an Aquarius or Gemini. I just want to put this out here. It's to an Aquarius or Gemini. And I probably will start uh, weekly readings tonight. Um, just saying, just saying. I probably will here in a minute. Okay? But this channeling is for an Aquarius or a Gemini. Um, okay? But before I say it, I want to say um, I've gotten several text messages today from several of my subscribers um y'all know i promote sun bendy tarot on here a lot because i think i don't know her personally i just want to put that on here publicly i do not know her personally not at all not at all i never spoke with her via text or email or phone or anything i've never spoke with her um i've just known her from the internet okay and i thought she was a very good reader and her readings resonated with me and they were good readings. I thought that would be good for you guys on the channel. That's why I started promoting her. But I got several, like five text messages from five different subscribers today telling me that she she has basically wiped her channel clean for all but like two very, 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 very short videos. Um, I don't know what's going on with that because I don't personally know her. So I'm just putting that publicly on here. And I told you guys that text me that. But I'm just putting it on here for everybody. I don't know her. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I hope somebody didn't scam her channel, bought her channel, or hack it. I don't know. I don't know. But um, I did check it myself, and they are right. There's just, as of a couple hours ago, there was only a couple very short videos, not even readings, a very short videos, like a minute long. So she might be revamping it or what have you, what have you. I don't know. But I checked it myself and it's the truth. So I don't know. <laughs> I'm just saying, okay. I hope she's okay. Son Bindi, I know you watch my channel. Um, I hope you're okay, ma'am. I just want to put that out here publicly. I hope you're okay, ma'am. I really do, okay? Okay. So, um, and people, uh, people were wondering what's going on with your channel. I'm just putting that out there too. People were wondering what was going on with your channel. They were texting me. But like I told them, I didn't know you personally. So, but I did check it out myself and sure enough, it's, it's, it's right. So I don't know. I don't know. Um, I hope you're okay, ma'am. I really am. Okay. From the bottom of my heart chakra, I do. Okay. So this is for an Aquarius or Gemini. Um, you could have Aquarius or Gemini in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or the Midhaven, Jupiter, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. But the channel message I received specifically for, I heard an, it was for an Aquarius or Gemini. So to me, this is like an almost personal for an Aquarius or Gemini. Um, I heard uh, this Aquarius or this Gemini, whoever these people are and how this resonates, it's at least two people in the universe. I feel this Aquarius or Gemini watches my channel or somebody's going to show this video to this Aquarius or Gemini if it resonates with them. How that resonates or applies. But this Aquarius or Gemini has been letting a Pisces, and I heard Pisces, so a Piscean energy, masculine or femme Pisces. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or femme, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. This Aquarius or Gemini has been allowing a Piscean energy to stay in a home, rent free. I'm assuming it's the Aquarius or Gemini's home, I'm assuming. But they've been allowing this Piscean energy to stay in a home, rent free, basically. Uh, Rent-free, mortgage-free, money-free, basically. But um, I heard for some of the Aquarius or Geminis, it's their baby mama. For some, it is their current lover. For some, it's their former lover. So Aquarius or Gemini, if this resonates for you, this Piscean, masculine or femme, is either your current lover, your former lover, or baby mama. So definite one femme energy, okay? You have to plug the Piscean in, how they resonate, Aquarius, Gemini. But I heard these Pisces, because there's at least three of them, 
current lover, former lover, or or um, um, baby mama. Um, I heard for some, they've already met someone. For some, they're about to meet someone. And I heard in a romantical aspect, and I heard they're about to leave like a thief in the night out of this home. For some, they're about to move out of state. For some, they're about to move, they're about to move not out of state, but, but far distances. And I heard they will not, um, they will not give you any heads up or notice. They're just going to do it. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, whoever these Pisces are. So I, this is for you, Aquarius to Gemini. Only you know if you're allowing a former lover, current lover, or baby mama to stay in a home rent-free, mortgage-free, bills-free, money-free. Okay? Um, but they're about to just up and leave. Like, I heard they're not going to tell you. They're not going to give you any notice. They're, I'm assuming they're not under a contract. I'm assuming. Like, you didn't put them under a rental contract. I mean, they're not paying money. So why the hell would you put them under a rental contract? That's just the truth. They're not paying money. So, um, but I heard they're just not, they're not going to tell you. They're about to just up and go. Whether they've already met somebody romantic in a romantical aspect or they're about to meet somebody in a romantical aspect. It sounds like they're about to meet. I didn't hear it was their love of their life or their twin flame or anything like that, but it's definitely somebody in a romantical aspect, whether it's somebody they're going to be with the rest of their life or a temporary person, and they're about to just up and go. They're not going to give you any notice, Aquarius or Gemini, masculine or femme, Aquarius, masculine or femme, Gemini. How that resonates and applies in this situation, okay? For one, they're going to leave the home a complete wreck, a complete wreck. They know you're attempting to hide them, but it's not a secret. Oh my God almighty, whoa, <laughs> that's why would you try to hide anybody unless you're trying to abuse them? Just saying, just saying, that's terrible. Um, so there's at least three of them. Um, I heard basically, um, for one of them, they're going to leave the home a complete wreck. So they're going to up and go and not notify you for one. For one, they're going to leave the home a complete trash, trash. But it doesn't sound like they're under any rental contract because they're not paying money. So I mean, hell, you can't even, it doesn't even sound like you can get them on damages or fees or cleanup fees because they're not even paying any money to live there. But they're going to leave the house a damn mess, I'll tell you that, um, for one of them, for one, because there's at least three. And um, they're just about to up and go, but it's about some kind of relationship situation. Um, for one, they are your current lover, but they've already met somebody or they're about to. For one, they're your former lover. They've already met somebody or they're about to. For one, they're your baby mama. They've already met somebody or they're about to. About to up and go. But I heard they know they're, you're trying to hide them, but it's not a secret because everybody knows. Um, so they're about to find a new choice in love, basically. And y'all know I don't get on here to do love readings, per se. Um, sometimes I do. Sometimes I do to be fun. But to me, this is this is real life. Um, this is unfortunate. This is real life uh, for pe at least three people in the universe, unfortunately. I would never want this to be my real life. That's just damn truth. Um, but this is somebody's real life, and that's just the truth. It's sad that they either know you're really trying to hide them or they think you're trying to hide them. That's sad. Nobody should ever try to hide anybody. I just want to make that clear. Sounds like an abusive situation if you ask me. Even though they're being able to li live there rent-free, mortgage-free, Money free, why are they being hit? You know what I'm saying? Or attempted to be hit. This is about to cause huge energy shifts. Huge. They're about to go and not look back. This is about to cause huge energy shifts. Huge. They're about to go and not look back. So these people, these Pisceans, masculine or femme, at least one's a femme, it's about to cause huge energy shifts. I think for you, Gemini, or you, Aquarius, and for the Pisces, and for the romantical partner. I didn't hear the sign on the romantical partner, whether they've already met them or they're about to. I heard for one of these situations, they're going to move out of state. For one, they're going to move not out of state, but far distances. So far locations, but not out of state. I didn't hear what states. Um, but it's about to cause huge energy shifts. 
and I, that would make sense for the Pisces that think they're being hid or they are being hid intentionally for the Aquarius and Gemini and for their romantical partner, either they've already met or they're about to, and probably other people connected to the situation. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. For one of you Aquariuses and Geminis, you live out of state from this person. It's about to cause you a lot of a lot of headaches. But no, this person is not going to look back. They are not going to. They are going. Oh my God. Okay, so for one of you, whether you have Aquarius or Gemini in your chart, whoever you are over here that lives out of state from the Pisces, that lives in this home rent-free, mortgage-free, money-free, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You live out of state from them. So I, I'm assuming you live in the United States of America, I'm presuming, because I heard out of state. Unless there's other countries with states. Um, but I heard it's about to cause you a huge-ass headache when they just basically up and go. And it sounds like because in one of the situations you live out of state. Uh, but I heard they're about to do it. They're about to do it. They are not going to care. They are not going to care, I heard. They're not going to care. They're not going to care. It sounds like they're about to do what's best for them. Definitely about to do what's best for them. Definitely about, about to do what's best for them. So they don't care. They're about to do what's best for them. But it's about to cause one of you guys a huge headache because you live out of state from them. Gemini or Aquarius. Okay. All right. I'm closing it here. I might work on some weekly readings tonight. I love you guys and namaste.